In the last video, we learned how we can easily install Commerce Kickstart. We also learned and why it is required, and we also configured our store by adding additional fun functionalities. So now, let's say you want to reach your shopping website. For that, type localhost slash the name of the directory in which you created the project. That is my demo card. After adding it, just press enter. So now you can see after pressing enter, our website first page is visible, which is our shopping website's first page. These are the default settings which are visible. Here you can see the images as well as the links. If you remember, we added we added a configuration options also and a store options in the last video while we were installing. So these settings are visible. Here you can see the header is visible, the header image. We can easily change it. We will see this later. Here you can see the default categories which are visible. Sample category 1, 2 as well as all products. Here you can see the ban banner. Through this you can easily add banners to your website. Here you can see the log login option and if you are not having any account you can create an account. On the left you can see the search option is visible as well as the cart option. Here you can see the currency is visible, INR, international rupees because we have set it before. This is the checkout through which a user can log in and select a product and can easily check out so that he can purchase it. Moving further, here you can see below the default links are visible, the company info, the service and support links as well as on the left you can see the like pages are visible like you can add a page straight away here like us on Facebook or Twitter. Below you can see that these many payment gateways are supported right now. Also you can see the copyright option like it is powered by Drupal Commerce that means it is governed by Drupal.org. So in this video we learned how we can reach our shopping cart page for the first time. We also saw that what options are visible on the first page. In the next video we will be learning how we can log in and log out from our shopping website for the first time. Thank you for watching.